Welcome to our health presentation entitled How to Take the High Out of High Blood Pressure. Over the next 15 minutes, we're going to help you understand a natural way to improve the most important tissue needed for the regulation of your blood pressure. Most people think that we'll be talking about the heart, and while your heart is critical to your health, there is a tissue that most people have never heard of but is absolutely necessary to help you maintain normal blood pressure. In fact, this tissue and its ability to regulate your blood pressure won three American researchers the 1998 Nobel Prize in Medicine. But first let me introduce you to Kim, for she represents both a success and a choice. At a health screening, her blood pressure was 182 over 112, dangerous levels and Kim had a choice to make. Did she want to go on medication or would she like to try a natural supplement designed to properly nourish the one tissue that controls most of her blood pressure response? Kim chose the natural supplement called Perogenine Plus and followed the protocol recommended to her. The result has been her blood pressure now averages 124 over 72 at the doctor's office. Her blood pressure is now in the normal range and Kim does not need to be on medication for this cardiovascular health concern. A true success story and we want to help you understand the how and why. We want to share with you information that most people have never heard of, yet since 1998 there have been over 120,000 studies that have shown the importance of this tissue and its ability to produce the master signaling molecule of your entire cardiovascular system. That tissue is called the endothelium and it produces a gas called nitric oxide. As you can see by the slide, your endothelium is a one cell thick layer that lines all of your vascular system. It lines the inside of your heart. The inside of all your arteries and arterioles, veins and venules are lined by this one cell thick tissue. Your capillaries are just extensions of the endothelium. Research over the last decade has clearly shown the endothelium to be an active multifunctional tissue that plays a vital role in metabolic, immunologic, and cardiovascular health. Scientists now believe that your endothelial cells ultimately determine the health of your blood vessels and play a major role in preventing cardiovascular disease and controlling blood pressure. Additionally, your endothelium is now considered the largest secreting tissue in your body. In fact, if you gathered all your endothelial cells together, they would have the combined weight of your liver. Yet very little has been done to educate people about this tissue and how properly nourishing it can benefit cardiovascular health, especially in the area of high blood pressure. But before we talk about nitric oxide, we want to make sure you understand what high blood pressure is. Blood pressure is a measurement of the force exerted by your blood as it travels through your vascular system. When your health care provider measures your blood pressure, they're recording two numbers, your systolic and diastolic blood pressures. When your heart contracts, it sends blood into your arteries. It's this head force of your blood as it pulses through your arteries that's being measured as your systolic blood pressure and is the first number that your doctor or nurse records. When your heart is relaxing, your blood needs to have a pressure sufficient enough to return the blood to your heart and properly fill it. This resting blood pressure is your diastolic pressure and is the second number recorded by your health care provider. For example, if you have a blood pressure reading of 120 over 70 millimeters of mercury, you would have a systolic or working pressure of 120 and a diastolic or resting pressure of 70. On the screen is a chart to help you understand the general guidelines your physician looks at in determining if you have a blood pressure concern. As you can see by the chart, if your blood pressure is 120 over 80 or below, then you have normal blood pressure. If your blood pressure is 120 over 80 or more, then you have some concern depending upon how high above these numbers your reading is. If your reading exceeds 140 over 90, then you have high blood pressure or stage 1 hypertension and you need to take this seriously. If your reading exceeds 160 over 100, then you are in a very dangerous category and you need to seek medical help to bring it under control. As you can see by the slide, your arteries are made up of three layers. 
The outer layer is mostly connective tissue to provide support. The middle layer is smooth muscle. This smooth muscle contracts and expands to regulate circulation and maintain optimal blood pressure. The inner layer is called the endothelium. Again, it's only one cell thick and it protects the integrity of the entire cardiovascular system through a wide range of biochemical actions, one of which is the production of a gas called nitric oxide. Nitric oxide acts as a signaling molecule. This means that it's used by the body to cause something else to occur. Because nitric oxide is an environmental pollutant, most researchers discounted nitric oxide in helping to control blood pressure. However, the 1998 Nobel Prize in Medicine was awarded to three American researchers who discovered how your endothelial cells convert the semi-essential amino acid L-arginine into nitric oxide, and how nitric oxide relaxes the smooth muscle in your vascular wall to improve blood flow. At the Nobel Awards Ceremony, the presenter of the Nobel Prize made this statement to the three American researchers, quote, Your discoveries concerning nitric oxide as a signaling molecule in the cardiovascular system lifted medical research into a new era, end of quote. And Dr. Louis J. Ignaro, one of the three Nobel laureates, had this to say about nitric oxide, quote, Nitric oxide can prevent, even reverse, heart disease and strokes, end of quote. Since its discovery, much has been learned about the role nitric oxide plays in your overall health and wellness. In the cardiovascular system, it plays three critical roles. First, nitric oxide regulates the muscle tone of blood vessels to have a major impact on controlling your blood pressure. Second, nitric oxide stops blood platelet cells from grouping together to form a clot. This helps prevent strokes and heart attacks. Third, Nitric oxide repairs damage done to the endothelium and is one of the keys to reversing atherosclerosis and hardening of the arteries. In relationship to your blood pressure, your endothelium plays a major role in regulating the smooth muscles of your vascular wall to contract or relax as conditions in the bloodstream warrant. The most important factor being the production of nitric oxide, which is a powerful vasodilator. This means that nitric oxide diffuses across the endothelium to directly affect the smooth muscle, causing it to relax. While there are many ways to damage the endothelium, it typically centers on four major factors, smoking, high blood pressure, elevated blood sugar levels, and elevated LDL or bad cholesterol. All of these directly damage the endothelium, which can lead to injury resulting in plaque formations and the start of atherosclerosis. Add stress, a poor diet, and a calcium imbalance and you have the makings for poor cardiovascular health and high blood pressure. Stress because it creates tension in the muscle groups which causes capillary beds to constrict. This increases the resistance to blood flow causing your diastolic blood pressure to increase which negatively affects your systolic blood pressure. A poor diet can limit the vital nutrients your endothelium needs to repair itself and properly create nitric oxide. A calcium imbalance can move calcium out of your bones and into your vascular system leading to the calcification of endothelial cells and hardening of the arteries. This directly affects blood pressure in a negative way. As you can see, the health of your endothelium is critical in the management of your blood pressure. You must properly nourish and repair your endothelium if you want to improve your body's ability to maintain a normal blood pressure. So let's talk nutrition for its key to nourishing your endothelium. To start, you need to understand how your endothelial cells use two natural amino acids to produce nitric oxide. The first amino acid is L-arginine. Most research indicates that for you to receive a therapeutic benefit from L-arginine, you need to consume at least 5 grams of this amino acid at one time. So we selected 6 food items that we thought would be common food choices. We did the math conversions to look at how much food you would need to eat to take in 5 grams of L-arginine. As you can see by the slide, peanuts provide the smallest quantity of food, but they pack on 70 grams of fat and 918 calories. When you examine the slide, 
you can see that the three best choices are one can of beans or two cans of tuna or almost one pound of chicken are needed on a daily basis. The other amino acid is L-citrulline. It recycles L-arginine to help turbocharge the endothelium's ability to produce nitric oxide over an extended period of time. There's not much of a food choice for this amino acid. Watermelon is your one and only good source. Unfortunately, 60% of the L-citrulline is contained in the rind portion, which most people never eat. When people realize all the food they need to eat and the limited menu they have to choose from, they begin to ask the question, is it better to get these critical amino acids through supplementation? After much research and study, we've determined that the best nitric oxide supplement in the marketplace is Prorogenine Plus, distributed by Synergy Worldwide and manufactured in the United States by Nature's Sunshine Products. Both Synergy Worldwide and Nature's Sunshine have received the NSF Good Manufacturing Certification, which means that they meet the highest standards in the nutrition industry for quality assurance and control. The manufacturing process to create the proprietary formulation of Prorogenine Plus is second to none. A total of 262 tests are conducted along the various stages of manufacturing to ensure the highest quality and potency of the ingredients used. In addition to having the right blend of L-arginine and L-citrulline, Prorogenine Plus also includes the following ingredients to help turbocharge your endothelium's ability to produce therapeutic levels of nitric oxide over an extended period of time. It's important to understand that this product didn't just happen overnight. This is a nutritional supplement that has both long and short-term clinical data to back up its ability to repair the one tissue that makes all the difference in proper blood pressure control. Prorogenic Plus incorporates Nobel Prize winning science, cutting edge vascular research, and pharmaceutical grade manufacturing to create what many consider to be the best nitric oxide supplement in the marketplace. What also makes Prorogenic Plus unique is that it has clinical application and studies to back up its effectiveness. The High Desert Heart Institute is located in Victorville, California and is considered one of the premier heart institutes in the world. In 2009, they did a human clinical study using Prorogenic Plus. This study involved 33 congestive heart failure patients who were all medically and pharmaceutically managed to the maximum. Over a 90-day period, these patients were given an aggressive amount of Prorogenine Plus. By the end of 90 days, all patients had their medications substantially reduced. We believe Prorogenine Plus can nourish your endothelial cells to help you properly produce nitric oxide, the master signaling molecule of your entire cardiovascular system, and the most powerful vasodilator for helping you control your blood pressure. This leaves us with a question. Would you like to take the 90-day health challenge to see if Prorogenic Plus can aid you in maintaining a normal blood pressure? If your answer is yes, then please talk with the person who recommended this presentation to you. They will work with you to help you properly nourish your endothelium for improved nitric oxide production, leading to improved cardiovascular health, which has helped many see significant improvements in their blood pressure.